Hi dears, let's find the solution for this problem. Consider the series summation n equal to 1 to infinity 60 sin n x divided by n into n plus 1. Is the series is uniformly convergent in any interval. So uniformly convergent, we can use this test that is Weierstrass m test for finding uniformly convergent. So the test is here, if summation fn is a series of positive integers with the condition modulus fn less than or equal to mn and if summation mn converges then you can say that the series summation fn is also converges uniformly for the interval. So now here we can take that summation fn that is this one conversion or not. So for that first of all we can check modulus 60 into sin nx divided by n into n plus 1. Right. So that is less than or equal to less than or equal to uh, we already know that the sin nx value is less than or equal to 1 for the real numbers. So here this is less than or equal to 60 divided by n into n plus 1. Right. So this is as like modulus fn less than or equal to mn. Now we have to check whether summation mn convergent or not. So for that summation mn. So what is summation mn here? It is summation 60 divided by n into n plus 1. Alright, so which is equal to summation 60 divided by this is here n square n into n n square value n square value uh, plus n value which is conversion according to the p test we know that p greater than or equal to sorry p less than or equal to 1 is divergent and p greater than 1 is conversion so according to this we can say that 1 by n square which is conversion now uh, if a summation mn is convergent according to the Weierstrass m test you can say that summation fn also converges uniformly so that summation fn so here summation fn means summation 60 into sin nx divided by n into n plus 1 is converges uniformly okay similarly we can see the next question we can see the next question the question here is if the series summation fnx where fnx is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus n square x converges uniformly on the interval close to 1 comma infinity. Okay. Let's see this one. So for this problem, first of all the same like the uh, previous one. So, we have to check modulus fn less than or equal to fn. So, for that modulus 1 divided by 1 plus n square x. <coughs> we know that x belongs to <coughs> close to 1 comma infinity. So, here we can see which is less than or equal to 1 divided by 1 plus x square because x belongs to close to 1 comma infinity. Again, we can say which is less than or which is less than not less than or equal to less than 1 divided by n square. So remember for all x belongs to close 1 comma infinity. So we checked this one modulus fn, modulus fn less than or equal to emn. Now we have to check whether emn converges or not. So for that summation emn that is equal to summation 1 divided by n square according to p test this is convergent. So summation mn is convergent. You can write that summation fn is also convergent. So what is fn? fn is 1 divided by 1 plus n square x which is convergent uniformly for that interval. Okay. So this uh, uh, converges uniformly means itself. You can use Weierstrass EM test for finding this. Thank you.